When our eyes see color, the signal our brain receives is a combination of light to dark, red to green, and blue to yellow. This is called tristimulus. The color we perceive is a unique combination of these three stimuli. The human eye can actually see almost 10 million shades of color. However, we have difficulty communicating the color to others, and our color perception changes depending on fatigue, mood, age, and many other factors. Hunter Lab instruments simulate the process of our eyes seeing color and our brain perceiving it. Instrumental measurement eliminates subjectivity, making it easy to quantify and communicate color. Similar to our brain, the instrument uses three values to define a color. The L, or lightness value, is zero for black and 100 for white. The A value is positive for red and negative for green. The B value is positive for yellow and negative for blue. This is called opponent color. Another way to look at it, the human eye will never see a reddish green or a bluish yellow. It is frequently important to know the difference between two samples or between a sample and a target standard. We will use the Hunter Lab Color Flex to measure the difference between a pair of green samples. The first sample is placed on the instrument measurement port and a button is pressed to take a reading. The values displayed represent that specific color of green. Here, the L value is relatively high, indicating it is light in color. The A value is negative toward the direction of green, and the B value is positive towards the direction of yellow. Next, we measure the second green sample. The instrument displays the color difference between the second sample and the first one. The differences are expressed as delta L, delta A, and delta B. If they were all equal to zero, there would be no color difference between the samples. In this case, the small positive delta L value indicates that the second sample is slightly lighter than the first. The negative value for delta A indicates the second one is more green, and the small positive delta B value indicates it is slightly more yellow. For quality control applications, tolerance values can be placed on the color difference for pass-fail determination. If you wish to have more information about measurement values and their meaning, please visit the Color Education page of our website. For more information about Hunter Lab products, please visit the Instrument section of our website.